I'm single, I'm single, I'm single, I'm single. I'm single when I'm lit, bitch. Tell that bitch I'm single, I ain't tripping about no thought who did me dirty. Oh, God. I'm just. You love people. I'm gonna turn off, sorry. But this is basically the behind the scenes of the video I'm about to do. So. I think I'm going to post a. Don't you know? I was going to post a teaser, but no, I'm going to post on Instagram when the video's up. So you might want to start following me on, um, on Instagram. I mean, <laughs> I'm going to post it on Twitter when it's up. So here are my social medias right there. I bet that's probably going to be the only time. Actually, I'm going to start. I'm going to put my social medias at the beginning of my videos and at the end of my videos. So. So I feel like this is gonna be at the beginning of my video, so this is going to be, you know, like right after. This will be right after the intro of my video. That will be it. You can't really see this. I just don't feel comfortable with that being <laughs> right there. All right. So this is on the scene of this whatever. So basically, you'll find out the name of the video, and also you'll find out the name of the video whenever you click the video, because obviously you found that very amusing. So, yeah, but, um, this will be the last time you guys see me before I actually start the video, so, yes, bye people. <laughs> What's up, guys? It's your girl, Kathy Cole, I'm back with my YouTube video, as you can already tell by the beautiful title that, basically, I created on my own, yes. I'm kind of creating on my own, I just, you know, basically, almost every YouTuber put that. But, you know, obviously, since I'm not above the age of, you know, to drink, I have a different little consequence for not answering. But, basically, I'm supposed to be doing the truth of drink, but teenager slash kid slash, just no, it's basically a teenager version, but it's not uh, all the way teenager version. Like, I kind of, like, got questions off of, like, like kids or tweens, which is teenagers. But if you're not tweens, it's just like, just anyway. But you know, basically. Oh, I got I got a little new setup or whatever. So you're going to be seeing. I hate that it's like that. Basically, you're going to be. Ugh, might be too low. What the heck? Anyway, so now it's basically. If it's shaking, I'm so sorry. I can't really. I don't know if you guys can still tell it's shaking, whatever. But it's cool. If, if, if I feel like it's cricket and I don't want to keep moving it. I don't because. Alright. So basically, I'm going to be doing, you know, a, truth, a drink video. But instead of doing shots or whatever, I'm still doing shots. But so instead of doing shots of alcohol, I'm going to be doing shots of hot sauce. Now, I know this is not the, the hot sauce I always get, but we didn't have any of that, so I just couldn't use this or whatever. Um, also, I got this it's from a place that we ate food. So, I'm just going to take a little shot of this, and then whenever that, I'm going to get like a little shot of this. So, whatever. So, basically, I have... I need to move this. Basically, I have this... This has 20 questions. Anyway, yeah, so this has 20 questions. Let's get my hair done finally for your pull. So I'm about to say you can go sit on my screen, but I'm not sure if it's still up. But if it is, my Instagram hair already popped up. So, um, basically, I decided to do something new, and I basically decided to do a little, like, behind the scenes, basically. But instead of doing it after the video, I did it before the video. So, I'm not sure how often I'll be doing stuff like that, but I will definitely, if I'm doing, like, like type, type, type of videos like this, I'll show you. So, I hope you guys like the little vlog, even though, you know what I'm saying, it was my first vlog, so, you know, I'm still, you know, trying to get used to, like, recording at a pub or whatever. So, basically, it is bright. It's bright outside. It's bright. But it was kind of like messing up the lighting a little bit, so I decided to just turn. I decided to turn on my ring light or whatever. Yes, but I got a ring light and I got a little phone stand or whatever, whatever you know what I'm saying. 
But anyway. Anyway. Um, yeah. So I decided to record this. It is, I believe, December. I wanna say I think it's December twentieth. Yes. No. Yes. Yes, twentieth, because it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Yes, so it's oh, got glitter. But yes, it is the twenty fifth. I mean sorry, it's the twentieth, Christmas in five days. So if you guys want me to record on Christmas Day, um I probably will record on Christmas night or Christmas Eve or the day after Christmas. Like just like show you basically the gifts or whatever. Most of my gifts probably gonna be money or whatever. I don't know. Cause usually, you know, when I was younger, of course we got Christmas gifts and then Corona comes and everything. So it's not gonna be the exact same, but I still should get at least a couple of gifts to open on, well, not on camera obviously because I'm gonna open it at the house of whoever gave it to me. But you know what I'm saying? I'll still show you guys what I got. I did get some Christmas gifts from my grandma's job, which is one the ring line with the thing I got. Um. I got like some type of like Beyonce little like lotion. Can you see that? Beyonce lotion. And then I got some perfume up there. Um, I'm not going to show you the box, but I got some Beyonce stuff like that. And then I got a gift that was for like a kid. So I guess I'm going to give that to my god sister. And then. Is that it? Oh, and also I got like a little like necklace thing or whatever so yeah you probably see it in a video if i ever wear it or whatever but yeah that's basically what i got but now that i've talked for five minutes straight and i got the minutes up a little bit okay usually i don't care about the minutes too much you know i don't care you just gonna see that your girl's big i'm big and i i don't care but basically <sighs> Just now, this, I'm not going to explain it, but just now, where I'm is not the best place, but I don't care. So, I want to know what happened there. Okay, I'm getting off topic. So now I've talked for six minutes straight now. Um, I guess it's about time that I get into the video. So, if you do not know exactly what truth or drink is, it's basically in the title. So, basically, we have 20 questions in here. So thank God for Valentine's Day. But 20, we got 20 questions in here. And then we have basically, you if I put out a question, right? I'm about to mix it up or whatever, because you know I'm gonna throw it in there randomly. But if I was to pull the question, imagine I pulled up this question, whatever this question is. Um and I basically had to, if I read the question and it was a truth, it's true. And if I don't tell the truth, if I don't want to tell it at all. I have to take a shot of hot sauce that's basically how it works and if you hear noise in the background it's probably my fan or people outside because yes my window is open at the moment so yeah please take me away please all right so basically i'm gonna i think i gotta center the camera because there's really nothing okay so basically let's go ahead and get right into this cute <sighs> mouth brand video i probably should have found something to drink but it's cool, your girl got it. I can take hot stuff. I'm gonna you a hot stuff too. I'm so like tempted. Just let's see how tempted I was. That's how this how tempted I was. But basically, yeah. Um. Also, you'll see the new hair on my Instagram. It should still be up there. Whatever. By the time this video go up, it's probably should still be up there. And I'm gonna post again today because because I'm doing a little Chris like little Christmas uh post every day thing. Which I'm going to try to do stuff like that, like, almost every day of the day, January, to de 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 <laughs> January to December and stuff like that. I want to start doing stuff like that. But it just depends on if I remember or if I can find anything that I want to do. So, let's go and get right into this video because I've been talking for eight minutes straight. I'm so, so sorry, guys. I'm so, so sorry. So, this light, I need to stop looking up because the light's going to blind me. So, we're going to go ahead and mix up. The little heart. Now, I'm gonna. Oh my, I almost dropped it. Now, we're gonna go ahead and put a question out of here. A question. We'll I'm pretty sure they all were like questions or whatever. So, 
I got the first one. Whatever. My freaking shoulder itch. So the first thing is y'all know how to see. Oh, how you guys can see? Because I was kind of like right really bad and stuff like that. So it's ugly. But it's basically how many best friends have you had in my in your lifetime? Basically in my lifetime. So. I was gonna think about a story time, but that shouldn't be a story time. But basically, it used to be like a little quick song. In my lifetime, I only had four, and to this day, I only have two. Now, I have two. One of them is my best friend, my bestie, my sister, whatever. People used to call her my twin. Well, I'm pretty sure they still call her my twin, whatever. But we've known each other ever since third grade. We're now in ninth, so it's been six years, boo. Yeah, six and next year on. I think somewhere probably June that'll make it um seven years so yes I'm gonna have two um the first two I lost one of them I lost them it, it wasn't no it wasn't all no it wasn't all no bad blood or whatever it's just that we don't talk as much but we still cool with everything like but we just don't talk as much um and then the other one I kind of with her it was basically it was just like a lot of like kind of like family drama with that with that friend or whatever do i still call her a friend mm, kind of but you know we don't talk as much either but we still have we still have contacts we're not on we're not on any type of bad terms whatever but you know i feel like if some people from my school or whatever still watch this video um i'm not sure if you're gonna remember who i'm talking about but just know that I thought, I thought that was falling. So, basically, yeah. So, we kind of, for some family things, we kind of ended off because of that. But, you know, we're still cordial, whatever. No drink on that one. So, yes, I only have, for my whole entire lifetime, I've only had four best friends. Lost two, still have two. Oh, and my other one, we've known each other for three years now. We're going on four, and I want to say maybe October next year like November October no cause I'm pretty sure it's probably it's probably yeah so I think it was the month before my birthday cause I remember we was talking about my birthday whatever but yeah we've been friends for three years now and then so we're still close. I talked I still talked to her. I still talked to other one for six years. Or whatever. But here's my next one. Oh my god. Oh, the strangest place I have ever used the bathroom. Um I wanna say maybe a bush. I think not a bush. Probably yeah, behind the bush. Cause I think we were doing like some type of road trip or something. I think I don't remember, but I remember we was in a car and we wasn't close to the house and I had to pee or something. I can't exactly remember, but I remember the train just place. I think it was like behind a bush or something, or basically in the grass. So you know, and it's kind of true because you know I'm a girl and you know whatever. So next question. Two down, still no shots. Am I scared of dying and why? Um, truth be told, I'm not scared of dying. Why? Because I know what's gonna happen. I know you can't prevent death. You can try your longest to live, but no matter what, you're gonna die. I'm not trying to be making it or anything, but I know that at some point I am gonna end up dying. Everyone's gonna die, so don't be scared of it. Um, how many kids? I mean, if I, when I have kids, and if I have kids, how many kids do I want? Well, I've always talked to, okay, I've always talked to my, like, me and my friends, me and my best friend, we always talk about kids or whatever, and I've always said I wanted a good three to four kids, um, and I've always wanted a boy as my first child or as my children, you know? So, yeah, I've always been someone that wanted a boy and I want three to four kids 
gonna have grandma. Mom's gonna have three to four grandkids and probably more if that boy in here decides to have some too. Um, a childhood nickname and why? Um, I think I'm gonna come up with my first. I'm gonna come up with a nickname my dad gave me, and then I'll give you one my mom called me too. So, basically. Well, I got really two nicknames from him, and I only I still only have one of them to this day. So basically, my nickname for my dad was Strawberry. And why? Um, because back then I I used to I really used to love Strawberry Shortcake, and then and then I love strawberries just period. So I was always in love with strawberries. I love um, Strawberry Shortcake or whatever. So. So yeah, that was basically the reason why. But and then my nickname from my mom was I think I think her first name was Think of But and to this day I think it's still Think of But. Um truth be told, I can't really tell you why, but I can guess maybe because when I was a baby I probably used to, you know, whenever a baby, you know. You know. Anyway. Um My scariest nightmare. I don't want to say that. Like, I'm gonna say it's embarrassing, but um, scariest nightmare. I want to say, uh, I can't think of one. So do I have to take a shot if I don't? If I can't think of one. So basically, it was this one night. I don't remember. I'm pretty sure we ended up watching a scary movie or whatever. And basically, it was nighttime, and that's why I don't watch scary movies at nighttime. Well, back then, why I never was able to watch to watch uh, scary movies at nighttime during the night. Um, I'm pretty sure we had watched a scary movie. And I don't. No, it was not scary. My bad. I'm trying to really get this. I'm trying to really think because it's hard. But. Uh, I think that I was sleeping obviously and I'm pretty sure I was at no because I basically I saw myself grown basically and child when I tell you I was looking cute as ever when I was grown poop I need to really look like that when I get older but anyway the glow up was magnificent so basically I was an adult right and you know how so I was I was out at night time and I'm pretty sure this is this is like way back then when I was like before I think before I met Jayla this is the time where me and my first best friend bestie whatever we were we would talk about moving in together whatever we're in the same college so basically we had lived we was living with each other and I think I had one out and I was out and I came back I was it was night time by the time I was on back on my way on my way home so basically, I decided to walk to the store, even though my car was right there. I don't know why I didn't just drive in my car, but I had walked to the gas to the store. I mean, I mean, to the store to get something. And for some reason, it was like the like I just hadn't noticed, but the streets like it was dark as ever. Like the street lights were on. It was nighttime. The only thing you could see was basically lights from like cars driving past. But I don't, truth be told, I don't think there were even people in the cars that were driving. So, mind you, this, the store lights are bright as day. So I kind of decided to walk by the trash, the dumpster, just to go to the store. Just because there's a lot of cars and a lot of people and me being shy and so sure and all that stuff, whatever. So I just kind of like try to avoid everybody. I, I'm I mean, I've never been afraid of clowns ever in my life so it was like this dream didn't make sense so all i remember is basically this clown tan like 
as soon as I walked, the clown's hand went like, 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 like this really quick. So I was like, and I'm guessing I, of course I got scared and I ended up getting pulled by my arm. My the dumpster's right here and the, the hand came from this way and it ganged me. I turned over and looked and I saw the clown. And the clown looked so, and it wasn't even a scary clown. It was like, you know, like the scariest clowns, like the sad clowns. You know how the clowns, like when they look sad. Ooh, why my voice sound like that? When they look sad or whatever. And I looked at it, and when I tell you, I screamed. That clown pulled me close to him, and when I tell his mouth opened so wide. And when I tell you, I saw black, I saw darkness, and then I woke up. So. For me now, that's the scary dream I can remember me ever having. Cause I don't think my other dreams, they weren't really scary. They were just like, like they say, me with my family, whatever. So, you know, basically it wasn't really bad. But I feel like it was, it was definitely probably one of the scariest, or the, basically only true nightmares I only had I've ever had. This was 19 minutes long. Have fun with the video, guys. I spent so much time on that one little question. <sighs> Alright, next question. Oh. Have I ever broken the law? Nope. Won't catch me doing it, boo. I am dumb. Not dumb. Won't ever be dumb. Would never be dumb. Um, next question. Oh. Three qualities important in a friend. Um, three qualities. Um, you gotta be able to be serious. You gotta be able to be chill. And, you know, basically, I just, I just need you to be able to match me up mine. And I'm more on the side of like a chill, more serious, more needed friend, like on the chill side. Like, I'm not the type, like, okay, so for instance, if I use me. And my best friend Jalen, basically, I basically already said their name too late. But I'm gonna use my for inference, Jayla. Jayla, me and Jayla are complete opposites when it comes to that. She is like more on the side of like wild, basically, and I'm on the side of chill. So I can be able to be wild as her, and she, be, and she can be somewhat chill as me. But it's like she's like really like why and i'm like like if someone's arguing with me i'm not the type to like instantly jump in and the reason why is because like i know myself i know my emotions i know how wild up i can get and i can and i know well i don't know everything i can do but i know there's there's things that i can do when i'm angry that i might end up regretting after doing or while doing it so i know how to keep myself in the frame of chill or whatever keep myself in the frame of chill so i just you know what I'm saying? Stay back, whatever. But basically, chillness, seriousness, and, be, and you need to be able to just cool, um, funny, and <coughs> serious. If you can't be serious, I'm gonna need it, then I don't think we can work. Because if you want to sit up here and try to be, <coughs> time, I'm talking too much. If you gonna sit up here and be crazy and wild 24 7, I can't because. It's like most of the time I like to just be I like to either like be by myself, be chill, just sit back and watch movies, eat popcorn, whatever. Like I'm one person that that would like to just chill and relax instead of like going out every night club and whatever, you know. Next, have I ever wet the bed? Yes. As a, as older like a think of teenager kid? No, baby. Yes. <sighs> And if I did, I don't remember. But I'm, I'm 95 percent, 99% sure that I've never wet the bed as an older, as older, like as four and up. I don't remember. I don't think that. If I was a college student, how would I be? I feel like I would be more of like the almost study 24/7 type of student, like study work 24/7. You know. I don't, like, I don't feel like I'll be the type of person to want to party instead of doing my work. Because my first priority in college was to do my work. To do my work was to 
what for me to do my work just because of my the type of like job I want to do I have to have a degree I have to I have to have some type of degree to do what I want to do I have a dream of being a nurse or of being uh, you know an eye doctor I've always wanted to be a chef you know so I've dreamed of opening up of opening up my own restaurant or being a nurse or just you know being an eye doctor and I'm sorry if I'm not saying the right words for the eye doctor I just can't remember at this point I can't but I feel like I'm gonna pronounce it wrong okay so next question have I ever cheated on the test <sighs> yep and I'm gonna mind you like in public school I've never cheated on the test in public school but online yes I've done it once and that was just because with that work it was so difficult because instead of it like they didn't give this much time to learn that um subject so they we kind of just hopped into a quiz and I was confused and I didn't remember too much so I basically I cheated on that test but do I do it like that no not on the test and I don't do it just like completely cheat on anything I do it to like when I find out there so I do the work okay I'm like okay I found it and then I Usually, I would go and see if I got the right answer. And if I didn't, I'm still change the answer. But, so, yeah. Um, next question. Hope you can't hear the noise outside. Because they're really loud. And I'm trying to talk as loud as possible. And I'm trying to make this video quick and start 25 minutes. So. Um, dumbest thing I've ever done on a dare. Um, for me, on dares, I don't really play truth or dare. But I feel like if I play truth or dare, it's like never in person. It's like in parties with like friends that I've met online or whatever. <coughs> so I feel like, some, like one of the dumbest things I think I've ever done that I can remember is I think it was me, Jayla, and two other guys at the party, right? And obviously me being me. I was talking for a good, a good little minute after, after I was getting to know each other, you know, saying, like, we gave each other our social media so we could see what each other looks like, right? So I kind of, I kind of had a little, like, a little crushy crush on one of them, whatever. And obviously Jayla knew because I told Jayla everything, right? Jayla has my phone number so we can FaceTime, we can text, whatever. So, no, Jayla didn't ask too much, was it? No, it wasn't Jayla. I'm pretty sure it was either Jayla or one of the guys, I believe. But I knew it wasn't the I don't I don't remember it's the guy that I had a crush on but I don't remember but all I know is that there was a dare and mind you I decided to do dare for the first time the whole entire game. The truths were not that were like weren't serious. I mean, okay, they're not doing really serious bad truths, so I'm just gonna do that, right? And it was and it was like and like and they said it's if we didn't do it I don't have to be like a pence if we didn't do it, but you know me, I don't want to go back on my on my words. So there was like someone said, "Do you like anyone in this group? Like, do you have any type of feelings for anyone in this group?" Me being mean, me being shy with a vlogger, I look quiet, and I was kind of like, I was kind of a little, a little hesitant on saying it. But I was like, I said yes. Did I say who? I said, and me being mean and trying to like throw it off the people, I was like. Hey, you don't know, I could like girls too. I said that. But I would say I don't like girls, so no. But did he ever find out who it was? Did he ever find out? <laughs> no. You still talk to this thing? <laughs> yes. But he says no. Wait. Okay. got that much in there and I haven't seen that one shot hmm. I think it's from the upstairs but no reason what do I what do I call oh what do I collect that no one knows about? I don't collect anything, so it's really I don't collect anything. Unless you mean the baddest the baddest girls. 
but everything else not. What's the color of the of your undies? First of all, I don't know. Mind you, I just wrote down random questions, so I don't. I didn't even think twice about the question. Do I want to expose my underwear on the internet? <laughs> no. See, I think I told myself I was going. I was going to drink nothing, but it hey, look what you're going to see. This stuff is strong. So maybe this was ketchup. I just tricked you guys. One second, I can take hot soup, but I didn't answer it, so that's the consequence, okay? Oh, wow. I did that because I thought I went around the room. Have I ever faked an illness, an illness to get out of school or anything? Yes. Uh, it might be something stupid. Like if there was like if my if my best friend like Ariana wasn't going to my wasn't going to school that day, or if I just have, like get up. But I think I didn't, I didn't really do that though. Like most of the time, I actually had an illness. I actually did not feel well, so. I had to ever have a person to fake anything. But basically, <clears throat> actually, no, I, I've actually never faked the illness to, if, I mean, I wasn't going to school, because I never, I don't think I remember ever asking her if she's going to go to school today. <clears throat> but if I did, it was because I just, I didn't feel like getting up. Or I really did have a bad illness. So... If I can marry one teacher, if I can marry a teacher in the school, who would it be and why? Well, I'm be honest with you. Most of my teachers have been females. And the male teachers that I have had were not compatible. But if I if I would marry one, and if I guess I'll just put out my was bisexual, whatever. Oh my god, that cut hurt. I think I probably would go for my uh, my old math teacher I don't I don't think it would be bad to say her name right as long as I don't say her her first name um my math teacher basically actually I don't know her name but my math teacher why cause she was like she was she was cute she was cute she was cute she was cute, she was cute. but you know I'm not gay so I'm not lesbian and I'm not bisexual so. oh Oh, the house is not sitting well. I need to stop moving so much. But, took me like two, three more questions. Have you ever gone skinny dipping? No. If you go skinny dipping, like naked in the bath? Yeah. But in a lake pool? No. That was a full burst of a burp of hot sauce. That was even over to a burp. Um, have. How many lip balms I own? I used to own a lot. I don't own no more. I don't own none no more. So, last question. Is this what I am? I just take the rest of that just because I didn't really drink. I didn't take a shot too much. So, if I do this again, I'm going to do it, but I probably like with someone so it'll be more interesting. What kind of PJs do you wear to bed? Um, I probably wear like a nice little nightgown or a long shirt with no pants. Of course, I wear underwear, but no stuff to hold up my chest or 
no socks. I can't sleep with socks. Or I just sleep in my underwear and bra. So basically, a nightgown, a long shirt, or pants and underwear. Not too much to really be ashamed of. Or a sweatshirt. I can sleep in a sweatshirt. But that's really it. This video is 33 minutes long. So if you guys enjoy it, I kind of tried to make it longer by giving you guys more bit more information but just because i didn't take much i'll take the little bit that's in here i'm like that probably is more hot than this Ugh. i didn't even drink I, I inhaled and freaking the my mouth i think i'm just used to it now and that's but yeah I'm gonna put my social medias right here again so you know go ahead and follow me on twitter if you want to see whenever i put a video or whatever um i'm gonna post something else on instagram so go ahead and help it to instagram and snapchat i might post something on snapchat it depends if i want to take a picture or whatever but yeah i'm gonna take a picture outside but yeah guys that's really it for this uh, beautiful beautiful video that i created if you guys want more videos like this if you want a uh, uh, twitter drink part two comment down below um i'm sorry that i did not upload the gingerbread video um uh, we did gingerbread but they didn't want my mom didn't want her face to be recorded and at point we had just got back home also because we was out all day so by the time we got home, it was dark, and, and she was like, if we don't make it now, I'm not going to do it. We'll see. So I just decided to make the video. I mean, the gingerbread house. And my phone was in my purse, so by the time I had about it, like, really getting it. So we made it. I did post that on my Snapchat and on my Instagram, so I'm going to go follow that also. Um, I don't know. This video might be posted. I'll try to post it today just so that you guys can see the pictures or whatever. But... You know I see it, whatever, you know what's going on. Great. I'm probably gonna record this like in like an hour or so because I think the house has to just sit in I think the house is just sitting like right here just because of how my how I'm sitting. But sorry guys. But and that's it. So um I'll see you guys on this video. Stay safe, stay blessed, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye guys.